Indie of the Year, Editor's Choice 2012. Never fails. Another year, another showdown. We should stop them. Took six months to patch ModDB's code after last year's Battle Royale. <sighs> I guess so. Someone's got to show them that violence is not the answer. <laughs> It's not too late to back down. If you don't want to get hurt. For what, you? Let's see how impressive your blood splatters are, Bugs. Yeah, round one, fight. I didn't ask you. Brains. Don't make me accidentally smother you. Short or not, my inventions will even the playing field. Not a chance. This baby is a harmless puzzle piece by day and a polygon slayer by night. You won't stand a chance. Please, no fighting in here. I lost my cheat code. Can I have yours? You sure you don't want to back down? Save yourself a humiliating defeat. In this corner, we have Phalanx from Blade Symphony. Hardly. And in this corner is Turner from Overgrowth. What's about me? Don't forget about me. I am the best candidate. Sign me up, too. Going to write this in my diary. I hunger for this battle! Look at all these medals! Clearly, Super Trench Attack is the best! <sighs> Stop! That's enough, guys. You're getting out of line. Disengage, please! Save your energy for the award show tomorrow. No katana. Uh-oh. It's the Pipsqueak Squad. I have a policy not to listen to anyone under four feet tall. Go back to the uncanny valley, shorties! How does a wrench have eyes, anyway? Careful, or I will reenact the gold member status. What? That's just wrong. Gunpoint. Interaction Award. Gunpoint is all about creative solutions. One of the most important aspects of any game is how the player interacts with the world around them and how that interaction rewards the player. In Gunpoint, you play as a freelance spy, taking jobs from clients that need you to break into high security buildings and steal sensitive data. To make it past security, you have an interesting gadget called a crosslink that allows you to wire together all manner of security devices, opening up a world of mind-bending possibilities. Wire a light switch to a trap door, distract a guard, and toss him out a window. Creative emergent gameplay is what makes Gunpoint special, and that's why it wins this year's Interaction Award. Sub Rosa. <laughs> Creativity Award. Sub Rosa is a high stakes, nerve wracking game about mobsters trying to make a deal. You have two mission types acquisition, where all teams try to intercept an AI controlled car and take a data disk, and transaction, where two teams try to broker a deal while the other team attempts to eliminate the competition. What the game turns into is a cluster of gunfights and high speed chases, and this deliciously immersive little title that will have you on the edge of your seat. Desktop Dungeons. Musicality Award. In a game about roaming creepy dungeons, the first music you might think of would be slow, drowning orchestral melodies of an eerie nature. Not Desktop Dungeons. From the music masterminds Danny Baranowski and Grant Kirkhope, Desktop Dungeons has a driving, epic soundtrack that makes you want to move quickly to slay your next goblin or explore around that next corner. Desktop Dungeons music gives you that feeling of epicness that goes oh so well for some fast-paced combat and exploration. Its musical uniqueness definitely stands out.
Fist Puncher. Worldly Award. Fist Puncher holds nothing back. In this action-packed old-school beat-em-up, with RPG elements, it will take you back to the glory days of 80s games and action flicks. With 15 playable characters, 100 collectibles is impressive. Its 50 levels of insane mayhem is the likes of which we have never seen. Toss cows at a meat factory to defeat your enemies. Or fight ruffians at a new beach. Bust out your baseball bat in this strange world of prison shivs and sledgehammers as you jump into a world of absurdity. Ballpoint Universe Visuality Award The debate on if games are art seems like a silly question when you look at an indie title such as Ballpoint Universe. Every bit of the game has been drawn with a ballpoint pen to build immaculate environments. Ballpoint Universe is a side-scrolling shooter platform adventure game about a doodle named Doodle. Explore doodle realms, meet intriguing eccentric characters, get hints and items to aid your quest. Fight for the future of creativity itself in one of the most beautiful indie titles this year. Surgeon Simulator 2013. The Risi 2013. Simulator games are normally serious, complicated affairs that can sometimes have more in common with on-the-job training than your average game. Surgeons have a deadly serious job filled with complex tasks and years of study. Surgeon Simulator 2013 mixes the two in a darkly humorous and often over-the-top bloody fashion. Armed with only an arsenal of clumsy and inappropriate tools and a hand that's semi-controllable, you try to save lives, mostly. The original prototype was developed in just 48 hours, but over time it's become an odd but fun joy for gamers. Chasm. Best Upcoming. Chasm is a 2D platformer action RPG that takes the hack and slash roguelike gameplay and marries it to a Metroidvania style platformer. Its aim is to immerse you in its 2D fantasy world full of exciting treasure, deadly enemies, and abundant secrets. You take on the role of a soldier passing through a remote mining town on a journey home from a long war. The town's miners have recently disappeared after breaching a long forgotten temple far below the town. Can you defeat the reawakened ancient slumbering evil lurking in the dark? We here at NDDB are so excited to explore Chasm, enough so to give it this award. Pixel Piracy, <laughs> best alpha funded indie. Every so often, a game will come around that instantly captures thousands of players' attention. Pixel Piracy excels at offering the sense of grand adventure on the high seas that would-be pirates yearn for. You're captain of a mighty sailing vessel, tasked with roaming the procedurally generated world, facing off against other pirates and hostile forces while recruiting and managing a crew of cutthroats. Yar! Monaco Best Multiplayer Everyone has at one point or another wanted to pull off the ultimate heist. To come up with a plan, recruit your group of thieves, each with his or her own specialty, then set out to make the big score. If this sounds like fun, you'll love Monaco. It truly is co-op at its best. Players rely on each other's diverse skill set to deal with guards, steal fat loot, and generally be sneaky, crafty thieves. Don't get caught missing out on an incredible title like Monaco. Rogue Legacy Best Single Player Rogue Legacy is one of those games you just can't put down. With addictive yet satisfying gameplay and a unique progression system not seen in past titles, Rogue Legacy is a joy to be had. Upgrading your keep, acquiring new gear and abilities. It's a game that will be played on for generations.
Editor's Choice Best Overall Indie. Third place, Desktop Dungeons. Second place, Monaco. First place, Rogue Legacy. Rogue Legacy checks every box for a fun, fast-paced indie experience like no other. Not only is it a game you would never see coming out of a mainstream developer, a title where death isn't the end, and a metagame that surprised us with its fun, unique way of progression, it had our staff playing for months after release, and fully deserves the title of number one indie title for 2013.